shit. Don't lie. You look at me nervous. So to start off this look, I've already done my eyebrows and everything just the same time. Now I will be uploading an updated brow routine this week because the last one I put up was shit. Shit. So I'm gonna be taking my one heck of a blot primer. I haven't put up a video in forever, forever. So I'm just gonna jump right into the eyes. I'm going to be taking a flat brush like this and then going in with some. I'm just using my Philosophy Miracle Worker Concealer in the color tan putting this ass in my face. It's so I know it's been like months since I put up a video. Which technically it's been my fault, but not really because I've been trying. To start off this wonderful look, I'm going to be going into my Makeup Revolution palette and taking this color right here. I don't know if you can really see it, but yeah, that color right there. And doing this on my brow bone to crease area. Just right now, I'm really into the reds, the oranges, and the raspberry colors. It's just speaking to me. So you know, I have to go into my all time, all time fave by Mac. It's this matte eyeshadow in the color rule. This has been coming through for me ever since I got it. You know, by me being darker skin toned, it's hard to find like really good colors that show up like, you know, my skin tone. So I'm going to be using this in like, I don't know, like an angled fluffy brush. I don't know. Something like that. I'm going to be taking some of this and putting this on a little above my crease and my outer corner like okay maybe it'll be better for you to just watch me than me explain it in my opinion i have to work with my curly freaking hair like i'm natural af right now oh my gosh guys i have so many great things in the works right now not many like you know not a lot but you know i have a few tricks treats treats up my sleeve that you guys will see soon very soon because right now i'm going to be i'm going to be more dedicated to youtube because i love makeup it's my passion but i just haven't had the motivation inspiration to like sit down and just really film a video you know actually like talk to you guys but now, like, I just woke up, it's like 10 something here in, well, my city. So, you know, I just woke up today and I was like, got inspired. So, I literally, I woke up and I started watching YouTube videos. I just got inspired. I'm like, today I'm about to film a video. Like, started getting ready, getting prepared, getting ideas in my head, like, around, like, 8.30 this morning. Like, the turn up started, like, I was going to do a voice over, but I was like, I haven't made a video in forever. I'm going to do a get ready with me type of video. Just so you know I can talk to you guys. The voice there was like, so, I'm about to do this. I'm about to do this. You know, that's not like interacting. I want to interact with you guys. So, okay. After I've applied the matte color on, yeah, just watch me. You can see what I'm doing. <laughs> um another brush oh i forgot to say okay so i've been putting like types of oils on my lips like while before and like while i'm doing my makeup just so my lips can get moisturized and it's been helping like like you know like during winter your lips start getting like chapped and like dry this has helped them like because right now i have argan oil i would usually put coconut oil on but i wanted to try this argan oil I'm like hey why not I like it. Like, it's not oily as the coconut oil either. You see, you can't even really tell I have it on. And I like that. <laughs> this big fluffy brush. <laughs> I need to come up with names for these brushes. Those are cheap offering kind. But hey, it gets the job done. I'm going into my Ulta Hello Beautiful palette. 
Mm -hmm. I'm taking this color right here. It's like a plum color. I just figured it would be great for this look. So I'm going to do that and I'm just putting this on the outer part of my eye. I'm just winging it with this look. I really have like no certain type of look I'm going for. I'm just, you know, using like fall type color. Hopefully it looks pretty decent. Maybe it won't. Maybe it won't. <laughs> you see how my freaking edges are curling back up? I hate it. I hate it. Being natural is not easy, guys. So, guys, I recently. Oh my gosh. I think I want to start doing like not hair reviews, but like hair videos. Cause I'll be watching hair reviews sometimes, and uh, it's. I get very bored of it. So I I'll make this wig. And oh my gosh, it was so cute. This was my first time like I was gonna like I ordered some hair off of AliExpress. Like I ordered a, I think a twelve inch, a ten inch, and an eight inch and an eight inch closure. Oh my goodness. Like the first when I was making it, I was like, oh this hair. Cause I was like after I had already ordered the hair, I came in and I started seeing bad reviews about it. I was like, oh my goodness, like this hair is going to be shit, like I'm not going to like it. But you know, when I was working with it, I actually, I liked it. It was pretty cool. And I had tried to dye it like this type of red, but it didn't go that far. So you just had like a kind of red tint, like more like a brown reddish than, you know, a bright red. So, I mean, it was still cute though. And then I had bangs. I had bangs, which I'm not a big fan of bangs. With that wig, it looks pretty cute. That's what I think what I might start doing more on my channel. You know, instead of just makeup, I'm going to start doing, you know, like, videos about hair. Because I'm natural, so I might, you know, do, like, a video about natural hair products one day. You know, just stuff like that. And then clothes. Oh, because I love clothes. I just recently got some really cute clothes. So, who knows what my next video will be? Well, my next video, I'm gonna tr try. I'm gonna try to get the updated brow routine this week, and then I'm gonna try to put up another video along with that. Like, we're just gonna be working nonstop, nonstop, guys. Cause you know, what are you gonna get in your? Where are you gonna get in your life? You know, if you don't grind, so you, know, you gotta grind and shine. Isn't that <laughs> I'm just talking. Let me just shut my mouth up. Dakari, shut up. Really, nobody knows what the fuck you're talking about. Let me shut up. So, I'm now going into my Mirabella palette and I'm taking. I was going to try to do all matte color, but I was like, oh, I really like this raspberry color. I'm taking this raspberry color right, right here. I'm doing the same brush I used to apply my transition color and makeup revolution palette. Just putting this in the middle and beginning of my eyelid. And then I'm just going to go back in with this fluffy brush right here. And then take a little of the orange matte color. And then I'm going to take a little bit of this brown color from Makeup Revolution palette and just like a splash of it and start, you know, blending all. Uh, and so I'm just going to do the same to the other eye. And after that, we're pretty much done with like shadows and, you know, put the little highlight on the inner corner and all that good stuff. <laughs> I'm very weird. Very weird. Sorry. I'm going to keep you guys updated, you know. So just to kind of smoke the look up a little bit, I'm going to be going into my Tarte. May the starlight be your spotlight. Or my double sultry. I don't know what the name of this palette is. <laughs> like I'm really, I'm just reading everything going to try to find the name. But I'm going to be taking the color Stiletto. It's a matte black color. I'm going to be going in with a real small brush like so. Taking that and putting this on my lash line. So that's pretty much it with the eye. And the foundation, my Maybelline Fit Me Matte Foundation in the color 355 Coconut. So I'm 
taking my Real Techniques brush, Expert Face Brush, and a second, how about I'm blending all this beautifulness in? This will always blend down to my neck, so you know my neck is kind of one corner, my face is another. I go back to my usual concealer, my MAC. Mineralized concealer in the color NW50. Y'all, I'm like really almost out. <laughs> I'm about to cry. Hmm, <laughs> this is like, I've been doing this for So, guys, my mom decided to up and leave me for death to go to Texas. So, I'm going to be taking a flat brush like this and just blend it out since there's really not much to blend out. <laughs> oh my gosh oh my gosh guys one like I want to say like a couple weeks ago like I not a couple weeks ago but like four weeks ago I started doing like the no makeup Alicia Keys movement it lasted for about two two and a half three weeks somewhere around there and I was actually loving it like I would wake up you know for school and everything I would save so much time not doing makeup like and I was actually like you know enjoying it, but you know, makeup was my passion, makeup was my love. So you know, it wasn't gonna last forever. But for the time being, I really like not wearing makeup. You know, it's saving me. So set my concealer underneath my eyes, just underneath my eyes. I'm going to take my Bare Minerals, Bare Pro. I really like the measure. So sorry, I put on blush off camera. I was over there at my makeup table and I just put it on. So I'm about to put on lashes. And I'm just going to be taking my Too Faced Better Than Sex Waterproof Mascara. And coating my lashes with this. Oh my goodness, I have concealer in my hair. Shoot me leg, John. <laughs> yeah, I'm about to put on lashes. Now I cannot find my tweezers. They're somewhere lost in the deep bottom ocean. I don't use lash glue. I use hair bonding glue. I mean, everybody knows lash glue never works for me. So, let this get tacky. So, just to blend my lashes in with the fake ones, I'm going to be putting some mascara brush. Oh, I'm going to be taking my pal Palladio, whatever, whatever the fuck it's called. I don't know if it's to you, Palladio, but yeah. I'm just putting this. I'm going to be taking my Becca highlight in the color Opal. Opal, Opal on my beautiful face with this big ass band brush. Oh my goodness, guys, highlight is popping. The highlight and put on the air. Number one, my fave, my fave, my fave. Back in action. Back in action. Now, I was really indecisive. Right now, I'm just going to be taking my Too Faced Melted Matte Lipstick in the color. In the color. What the fuck is this in the color of? I don't know. Sorry, my camera died before I could, you know, while I was putting on lipstick and I didn't even know it. But this is the final finish look of this fall makeup tutorial. Fall glam, fall slay. I really don't know what I'm going to call it yet, but here's the finished product. Now, I just want to thank you guys for watching. Have a wonderful, wonderful day. Mwah.